Kedala Art of Living 2022 exhibition was declared open by Industries and Plantation Industries Minister Dr. Ramesh Patharana at the BMICH yesterday. The exhibition organized by Asia Exhibitions and Conventions Private Limited will be held until tomorrow, scheduled from 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. at the Bandaraniki Memorial International Conference Hall Colombo. The exhibition will consist of approximately over 200 stalls to attract more visitors from every occupation. decided to conduct the exhibition again, it's a much needed time, so it's a timely move. We haven't had a decent time for the last four years, starting from Easter Sunday bomb attacks, then Corona enveloped the whole world, our economies were badly affected, then economic downturn, our economy collapsed. Now it's a global recession with war in Russia and Ukraine. So all those mul uh, the multitude of factors had affected our economy pretty badly. And much needed uh, infusion, capital infusion from the government, government uh, capital, infra, capital investment will be gradually reducing in time to come. So it's timely that private sector people have come forward to restart. Some, uh, this construction industry some, is something worst affected by the economic downturn of the country. But as the Minister of Industries, we'll try our level best to ensure that we will also infuse some capital and also we try to solve some of the issues pertaining to construction industry. One thing is the cost of raw material. The second thing is the difficulties they face uh, because of the temporary suspension of some of the items and also the huge cost for the purchase of the consumer. So it will take some time for the things to settle down as per the financial experts. We keep, an, keep, we keep our fingers crossed that things will come back to normalcy. But during interim period, it's the responsibility of the government and also the other financial institutions, especially like Ceylon Bank and the other banks of the country, that they will provide decent financing mechanisms to ensure, from one side, the, the producer, manufacturer, and the importer is not penalized a lot, and also from the other side, more importantly, people who are the receiving and the customers get a decent, uh, decent break or a decent deal from the financial institutions. So whatever that was happening in the country, we hope that it was vote under the bridge. And all of us are keeping our fingers crossed. General population of the country are very positive. So with your inputs, we hope that things will bounce back to normal situation in 2023 with much expected positive growth of the economy. So let me thank again on behalf of the, uh, the ministry, especially your program is con uh, connected to some worthy courses as well as I learned. One thing is the Indira Trust. They, are, they get a share from this one for their valuable course. And also SOS Children's Village. They are also getting a good share out of this exhibition. So it's not profit oriented. It's basically connected to other social activities as well, which are of uh, worthwhile mentioning. For more latest news, subscribe to FTTV.